painful last Just night of the regular season. bad shot. It made me stop and go, power my, my. A lot of people in their stand-up comedy have a crutch, something they go to. I had two stretchers. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Bush and Madden. No, you know what? I, I, here's the deal, I think, right now. Uh, that was almost Madden right there. Here's the deal. Uh, you know, <laughs> uh, the, the, I think, actually, it's, it's kind of a good thing for me in a way, but you have to remember, John Madden has not been shot, okay? Right. So it's still okay to talk about him. It's not like when Vaughn Meter couldn't do JFK anymore. Right. right. Because, <laughs> because the whole nation was mourning. Uh I asked. I I I, I, I talked to a couple of reporters because people were doing this type of story about me. That's the that's the funny thing I find about the the, the media is that like actual real media outlets, uh, well such as yourself, I guess. But you guys do more of an entertainment type show as well. But people were doing columns on what will Frank Caliendo do now. <laughs> uh, but. Um, uh, you know, it, it's it, it, Madden will actually be a story until the season. You know, think about this. It's actually kind of people will be talking about, oh, John Madden retired, John Madden retired. Uh, and then during the season, people are like, do I miss John Madden? And then I think after that, it'll trail off. But it, there, I think Madden's also left it open a little bit. Uh, that he may be doing some other things here and there, and uh, and, and and we'll see. So so maybe. Uh, and the one thing that I wanted to say about some of the media outlets I talked to, I wanted to make sure, uh, you know, because you don't want something. To, it came out of the blue, so a lot of people were worried that something might be, uh, you know, wrong with his health. Which I've been told by a few people, they said, oh, absolutely not, he's fine, and and so they they've talked to him and stuff. So hopefully that's the case, and he just made that decision, you know that. At, you know, at 73 years old, guys, it's time to start spending time with my family, you know, you know <laughs> spending time with my grandkids, and they have grandkids, and their grandkids' grandkids, and <laughs> what I want to do is form a team uh, uh, of players, that, you know, uh, football players, and play against Brett Favre's family tree. <laughs> I think that would be a lot of fun, you know. I mean, you know, you know, you know we like Star Wars, the Clone Wars, but with, with grandchildren. I think you know, that's what makes that kind of thing fun. People were asking me too. They said, uh, "Do you think Madden retired because Brett Favre retired?" You know? <laughs> and you know that you know, that 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 did uh, that did probably figure into the situation there. You know, the the decision made. You know, maybe a little bit, only 99 or 99.5 percent. But the other 0.5 percent was grandchildren in that football league. And I think, I think that's really what would make it good. If he truly is done with sports, will eventually, will he be out of your act for good? No, I don't. I, you know, I I don't think I could go up on stage and people and not not start yelling out "Do Madden." You know, that's. I mean, that's that's what people. I, that's the first breakout impression I ever had, where people were like, "Just do Madden, do Madden, boom, I'm doing it, settle down." You know? <laughs> uh, watch out, or I'll run you over with the cruiser. You know? <laughs> Which, by the way, I'm turning into a hybrid now that, you know, because you want to, you know, it goes to, from zero to 60 and 60. So, <laughs> but, they, you know, that's going to be a lot of fun. Still can put the groceries in there and stuff like that. Catch Mike and Mike every weekday from 6 to 10 a.m. Eastern on ESPN Radio and on ESPN2.